Hello to all our Tetchy friends! This is our next tutorial in our series on web scrapping using Python. I'm Scrappy and this is Worth Web Scrapping. There we go! Hello to everyone and welcome to World Web Scrapping. This is our next tutorial on web scrapping using Python. Today we are going to scrap some data related to jobs so we are going to go to this uh, monster.com and uh, we are going to scrap data related to jobs from here so this is uh, monster.com australia and i'm going to scrap data i have searched for this job software developer in australia and so that's uh, what i'm going to scrap today so in this particular website what uh, we are going to scrap is um, that uh, title of the job the company that is hiring and then we are going to scrap the location that the job is at so this is a particularly easy to scrap website not a very hard one and uh, so this uh, three information that we are going to scrap and we are going to put it in a pandas data frame mm, so uh, let's uh, get to it and see how we can do that okay so let's go so this is again like importing my request library this is my url and i'm sending a get request so same as it is and then import my beautiful soup library as soup checking the status code of the request that is 200 so we are okay with it then creating my beautiful soup object and checking with uh, my beautiful soup object so it looks uh, okay to me and we are seeing all of uh, these classes so it is uh, just a good response and we are good to go so let's see we are getting that title of the job so if I go here inspect and the title comes this header here and we can go to this header and go to this class card header or we can go to h2 tag and from their class title so that's uh, what I'm going to do h2 tag and then from there I'm going to this class title and I'm going to grab these uh, text out of their software developer and designer so that's uh, what I'm going to do and let's see in the code so creating an empty list again and writing a for loop bs object dot find all h2 tag and from there find this uh, class title and from there what are we grabbing is uh, just to uh, dot text and dot stripe and append into this title list and let's run it so we have grabbed all of the titles and let's check the company name now this is the company here and inspect so singapore telecommunications limited and uh, so it's again simply so we have to go to this uh, div go to this class company from there we can go to span tag and just take out the text so that's uh, what we need to do so let's get to code so again creating an empty list company and for writing a full loop again so bs object dot find all doing a div class as a company and you like doing a dot text dot strip and appending it into back to my company list and showing the complete list here and we have uh, grabbed all the company names so it's a uh, pretty easy to do this one then let's check our location and the location is well, location location is so location is here let's check this location it's Mac Mac Macquarie Park and location is again in div tag and the class is location just take the span tag we can go to the span tag or we can go uh, we can do this a uh, div and just uh, take the text out so let's uh, check the code and so guys and that's uh, what I'm doing creating an empty list for location bs object dot find all going to this class location and doing the dot text dot stripe and let me 
just remove uh, this line for first and I will show you what's happening here uh, control enter so when we do this so we get this is uh, one line extra that is a location uh, and X so we are getting this uh, one line extra from the page so we don't want that so for that reason I'm just uh, taking out the element starting from the first index so that's uh, what I'm doing so just removing that now let's create a pandas data frame so to do that I'm going to create a dictionary from all of my list so I'm defining my dictionary here d1 and creating this a uh, key title and my list is a uh, title company is my key and my value is a company then location is my key and location is my value so this will create a dictionary and from this dictionary we can easily create a pandas data frame so import pandas as a pd and to create a data frame pd dot data frame dot from dictionary and pass your dictionary that we have created here right at the top so let's run that and it will very easily create me the all of this uh, nice and clean data frame and we have all the details that we need here so that's uh, what I wanted to do here now what we can do further after that is uh, we can go to each job and we can grab all of the details that are provided there so to do that what we will do is just click on this and this tag actually contains the link of that so if I go to this h2 tag and the class title from there if I take this href out this href has the link of the job so I will take this href out then I will send a get request to all of these HRF so all of these links that I will get out from this HRF and from there I will grab all of these details that are provided here so if you see on the job page when we comes to this job page we have a lot of like position summary key responsibilities experience and qualification and a lot of details are available there so what we are going to do is we have going to scrap all of these details also so let's check where they are coming actually so guys I'm just uh, going to grab you like uh, all of the details are in one go and I'm going to print it so to do that let's see where this uh, job is actually coming so if we see here this uh, complete job is coming under here so if we just go to this uh, div tag I assign this class called MD8 and from there if uh, we just go down further and if we see this uh, div ID then we have uh, this uh, div class if we just uh, do a dot text out of that we will get all of uh, this data so that's uh, what I'm going to do actually so let's see how we do that so again creating an empty list and I'm going to grab all the links from HRF so writing a for loop go to this h2 and class title from there and just go to a tag and from there just uh, give me the HRF attribute that's um, what I'm doing here and if I run the cell I will get all of uh, the links so these are the links of all of uh, the jobs that are we have now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to all of these links individually one by one so for link in links and I'm going to send a get request to all of these links one by one creating again a beautiful soup object and from there what I'm going to do is uh, do find all div class called MD8 so right that I showed you from there I'm just simply doing a dot text and dot strap and if we just run this we will get all the details of that are given there so let me run this and it will take some time because it is going to grab a lot of data so if you see we are getting description title software developers and designers three and location is uh, McGuire Park this uh, was our first job that we saw and position summary then we have all of uh, these position summary coming here so I'm just printing it if you want to uh, you can store it in a data frame or anything that you want so that's how you know we are getting all of uh, the details so there are a lot of uh, details so it is uh, going to run for a while so it is uh, completed and we have got all the details of all the jobs here actually so information services uh, EIS provides a complete optimized research solution so we have all of uh, these uh, details and so this uh, was 
EBSCO that was the last company that we saw there if we see it uh, one more time and um, here you see this is uh, our last job so we have uh, grabbed all of the jobs that we wanted so you can do that and this is pretty easy to scrap website you can grab all the details that you want and that is all for today my tetchy friends if you like the video please like and subscribe to our channel see you in the next video tutorial and do not stop visiting our website leave your comments below and ask me any question you have i will be happy to answer them link is given in the description of this video to get code and full material stay happy stay safe stay tetchy